this is Abisa. Is that good? Yes, that's what's good. That was good, wasn't it? So, Abisa's been coming to the course that Jenny and Jill and myself have been running. And I know at first you were, you were sat there saying, well, you can't teach an old dog new tricks. And I'm sure that people looking at this video now will be like, where's the old dog? <laughs> but... <laughs> <laughs> but tell me, is that true? Um, I think I, I, I can change my statement a bit because um, I think from the past week that I, I've learned so much and I now know that it's all up in your mind. It's the power of your mind. And I know that at my age, I can be taught new things and also if I open my mind to it and the way that I view things it's all stuck in the mind and then it goes with your feelings so yeah um, I don't think it's true anymore all dogs can be taught new tricks go. excellent mm -hmm. excellent so is there anything specific that has that you've noticed that since since doing the training is there anything that's specific that you yourself have realized Definitely. I think one of the things that I've noticed is the, the, the workshop has changed. It has changed myself. Firstly, I think the change needed to be done within me. Also, it has changed my relationship with my brother, my relationship with my family, my relationship with my boyfriend. Because I think for 17 years, I had my brother who was always on my case and I find him so irritating and he was boring. I always thought that he was acting white and he did things the way white men would do it, not the way that we black people should do it. And I wanted him so much to conform to my expectation of how a black man should do things. And after attending the training, I think I saw the way that I viewed him, the way that I saw him, I knew that he cannot conform to my standards of living and or what I think the black man should act like. Um, the fact that he would come home, give mommy a kiss. When he goes, goes out, give mommy a kiss. That's what white people do. We don't do that as black people. And it was up until that I realized that that is who he is. So I should not try and change him to what I believe that it's right, you know. So I think also the fact that um, I've made peace with a lot of things uh, and also not try to make peace with the, with a lot of people around me not try to let them see the way that things the way that i see them and want them or force them to to believe what i believe them to what i believe in you know everybody has got a choice to believe in what they believe in so i think i'm more at peace with myself and i'm more at peace with the people around me so that was that is what has changed now that is that is awesome so that's in your personal life what about work do you think that this would affect your work life? Uh, definitely, <laughs> definitely it will. I think also, I'm, I'm at the point now whereby I know that when my manager is, is not happy about something that I should have done, he's not really attacking me as in person, he's only not happy about the situation. And then it should not change or it should not affect me emotionally you know so much that I go into his office and even though he has sent me an email calling me into order I go to him with all smiles like what are you smiling at Toby's I'm like nothing you know <laughs> the way <laughs> the way that I am now towards him the way and when I look at myself now and some time ago last year I would be in tears you know I would like oh I don't like him he doesn't like me all of that but now I know you know I I think I'm more peaceful and it's it's like I, I found new peace within me how I wish that I was thought this earlier on in life you know so much would have <laughs> before you got old yeah before I grow old you know, <laughs> something so much I would have done so many things differently I would have looked at life so much differently however I'm, I'm just grateful that I also working in this organization I got an, an opportunity to attend this and it can only make me a better person be it it's personal it's in work towards my colleagues the relationship that I'll build with my colleagues moving forward 
with the management and with the community that we serve. Beautiful. Awesome. Abisa, thank you so much. It has been a pleasure. Thank you.